Hi Catherine, so this vlog is um, about sustainability um, and the corporate and social responsibility. I'll be referencing the Ego and Dahl's book Marketing Ethics in Society as well as examples from our debate in class. So um, what is GDP or gross domestic product? Um, GDP is defined by Eagle and Dahl as the total market value of all final goods and services produced in a country in a given year, equal to total consumer investment in government spending plus the value of exports minus the value of imports. Um, so they highlight also in the books some things to think about in regards to that definition um, in itself and Things that are included are, um, in that definition are things such as product, uh, production of weapons and cigarettes um, and items of things that aren't included are things such as air or water pollution as a result of production. And so this shows the limitations and potential for misuse of the GDP. And unfortunately the GDP remains the predominant measure of prosperity. Um, as marketers, we must consider the validity um, of the criticisms directed at marketing activity and consider how to coordinate the satisfaction of customer wants and needs with long-term measures that include environmental resource factors and the needs um, of future generations. So our class debate was to agree or disagree with the following statement. Businesses should think beyond making money and shareholders happiness and pay attention to social and environmental issues. I agree with this statement um, and although obviously we don't all think that way um, or I'm sure our environment wouldn't be suffering how it is um, currently. So businesses have more um, have a more immediate impact on the environment quicker than the government as they are quicker to act and consumers um, get the messages quicker. So we have a huge responsibility, businesses have a huge responsibility for the environment. Um, the next generation of consumers is going to have to deal with repercussions of businesses decisions we make now. Um, we are all shareholders in our country so we need to care now and put things in place for the next generations. Sustainability is often referred to or framed as um, a triple bottom line approach um, as it incorporates economics, um, social and environmental impacts. Um, it is closely linked with corporate social responsibility or CSR. And this approach is designed to show an organisation's commitment to the social um, environment in which it operates with the following assumptions. Number one is corporations should think beyond making money and pay attention to social and environmental issues. The second is corporations should behave in an ethical manner and demonstrate the highest level of integrity and transparency in all their operations. And the third is corporations should be involved with the community they operate in, um, in terms of enhancing social welfare and providing community support through philanthropy or other means. So there is an increasing number of consumers who are supporting businesses that can demonstrate good CSR. And businesses must be more transparent um, as they are and given more to social pressures because if they don't, they're just going to get such bad publicity for it. So for example, L'Oreal have pledged to become an free of animal testing by 2020 um, due to social pressures. Um, and then there's like Nike, um, who are exploiting their workers in poor countries, who now have set up an extensive system to monitor factory conditions in, um, throughout its supply chain, and that's due to social pressures as well. So both parties, the marketer and consumer, play a role in sustainability. If all things were equal, it is claimed that most consumers will select environmental sustainability, but the decision process becomes more complex when price, quality and status come into the decision-making process. Um, if the decision-making process is too complex, then, usually, then usually, usually sustainability is disregarded. So we as Mars members need to attempt to make our brands that we come into contact with more sustainable um, and make more sustainable decisions as consumers as well. Um, 
and look to buy the more sustainable option. Thank you.